Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and today we're going to be talking about the Shiseido Color Spark Moisturizer. Is this pronounced Waso or Waso? I'm not 100% sure. Really, really quick video. I want to do something um, that just shares my thoughts about this Color Smart Moisturizer. It's really great. It's an SPF, it's a moisturizer, and it's kind of a BB cream because it has color blurring technology. Disclaimer if you're looking for something that's a lot more full coverage and is going to give you a lot more perfecting aspects to your uh, day, this is not really the moisturizer or the SPF Color Smart BB cream for you. This has the color blurring technology, so it does go on you put it on and it just pretty much comes off white and then what you do is you just rub it into your hand and then it starts trying to like match with your skin tone which is really great and it does work on most skin tones i tried it on my really really fair friends i tried it on you know myself and also people who are similar to my skin tone and i've tried it with some of my friends who have deeper skin tones and so it worked for most it did not work for one of my friends who has really really deep skin so it left a little bit of an ashier grayer tone on her and that wasn't really something that worked well because she had more deeper red warmer tones in her in her skin it didn't look right on her so I would give uh, that a thought if you have really uh, tan or darker skin and you don't know if you want to go this route or not it might not work for you I'm like that true beige color and <laughs> it works well for me I have really dry skin and so this is a really good moisturizer because it's light and it kind of does a good job at keeping me hydrated but it's not heavy and especially if you want to put more makeup on top of it and, and have it act as your SPF um, and kind of like a primer it doesn't give you more like weight on your face but for me I wear this by itself I put it on in the morning on the train when I'm going to work so I you know put it on my hand and I just like rub it on my face it's really good for commuting especially if you want to put on a moisturizer and an SPF and some kind of like coverage on it just you know eradicates all of those like extra stuff you only need to do one so it's great and it also gives you a nice little kind of like healthy glow so I really like it I get a lot of compliments that my skin is really like you know glowy when I wear it or I look really like healthy and I'm just like guys I'm just wearing it yeah like whatever <laughs> If you have oilier skin it might slip a little bit but I only have dry skin so I only know what it what how it functions on me so if you have oily skin yourself and you notice that it does kind of like slip off uh, let a girl know I would love to know if that happens to you in terms of coverage for me it's not something that does like the job of as acting as a foundation even though for me I do use it as my acting foundation at the moment because I'm not really wearing foundation that much anymore I'm trying to improve the quality uh, and texture of my skin so right now I'm trying to keep it really simple on the face um, I do wear like another layer if I want to add a little bit more coverage I'm not really 100% sure if it does anything extra but it does brighten a little bit more so I kind of put on a second layer if I want to go under my eyes and give that a little Bit more brightening effect or if I have a, a, an, a blemish that is kind of like you know noticeable and I kind of want to blend it out a little bit more I do put a little bit more on it just to see if it will actually do something and maybe to just give myself peace, peace of mind maybe it's a placebo effect I'm not 100% sure it does have a scent so if you are you know sensitive to scent it does have a powdery floral scent for me it you know I like it it kind of smells like some you know baby powders or baby uh, baby skincare products that we grew up using in the, from the Philippines. It reminds me of the products that we would receive in our Balak Bayan boxes of your kids. So I like the, the scent. It's a nostalgic scent to me, but if you are something, somebody who is really sensitive to scent, this might not be the one for you. And of course, it's an SPF, so you definitely want to know how it works as an SPF. And I have taken it on vacation to very, very hot places like Texas and like, you know, um, Texas. I think that's like the hottest place I've taken into Texas in August which is a very hot place it does a good job at protecting my skin which happens to be really sensitive and burns really easily so I think that it does a really good job of proving its SPF qualities and I wouldn't say that it's better than any other SPF but it does help protect your skin and is also not going to make you feel kind of cakey or dry or leave like a super zinky white cast on your on your face like this does not do that which I really appreciate I think it's due to the color smart technology honestly which just clicked in my head right now overall I bought this at Sephora for $38 so it's kind of not 
cheap it's definitely not cheap but for the price that I was paying for the amount of stuff that it was going to provide me with I thought it was a really good deal I was just going to buy like a singular SPF for about that much or more so I thought that this was actually a really good deal for me and you know me I'm all about the deals and steals I really liked that it was under 40 bucks I think it's under 40 bucks it's been about nine months since I bought it so I'm not 100% sure I'll put the price somewhere up here if you're going to get daily use out of it I think that it's a really good investment to make it has to be like super worth it for me to buy it and I definitely think this is super super worth it especially if you're on the go or if you're like a crate if you're like a you know have a crazy schedule or if you're like a working mom or just you know working from home this is a really good product to have in your arsenal because I feel like it gives you a good everyday phase without a lot of effort and I'm all about the no effort part <laughs> That is my video. I highly recommend, give it a go. If you know of any other products that are similar to the Shiseido Cover Smart Technology Moisturizer, let me know. I would love to give it a try. I'm pretty much at the last bit of this one, so I think I may have like a week or two left with this and I'm gonna have to go buy some more. I would love to hear your feedback before I go ahead and buy this because I don't wanna miss out on these new technologies out there if you guys like this video go ahead and give it a thumbs up and if you want to go ahead and leave a comment down below with your thoughts i'd love to hear from you i'd want to go ahead and bring a conversation going i want to know why people don't talk about this product more i feel like this is something that has changed my life so i don't know why it's not more popular if you know why like the other product that chumps this one please let a girl know because i don't get why there's no like cult following behind this yet i want to go ahead and follow me subscribe to this channel we're going to be sharing we as in i guess you and me moments of our lives together now mostly me in the form of making videos for you i wanted to go back and bring this channel back to beauty but also talk about lifestyle stuff i'm older now i have a little bit more experience in life and you know i started this business and now that we're in shelter in place i have more time uh to kind of share more insight that i have and just share this crazy um lifestyle and some ideas i have with you so i I really hope you are cool with that and you want to go and follow along follow me on social media if you want the links are down below here and also below below but you guys thank you again for watching this video and I hope to see you guys soon bye